An effective comparison and contrast essay doesn't just list similarities and differences. It organizes them around specific aspects or criteria that make the analysis meaningful. For instance, if you're comparing online and physical composition courses, are you analyzing aspects like accessibility, interaction, and assessment methods? By establishing specific criteria, you provide a structured framework for your essay, making it easier for readers to follow your arguments and see the logic behind your analysis. Ensuring that these criteria are clearly defined and consistently applied throughout your essay will not only strengthen your writing, but also showcase your ability to think critically and systematically. An essential element of a strong compare and contrast essay is a well-organized structure. There are two primary formats to consider, the point-by-point -point method and the block method. The point-by-point -point method alternates between comparing specific aspects of each subject, making it ideal for detailed comparisons. On the other hand, the block method discusses all points about one subject first and then moves to the other, which works well for broader comparisons. By following one of these logical formats, you ensure that your arguments are easy to understand from one point to the next. ChatGPT can also help identify areas where your structure may falter and suggest improvements. A key feature of a strong compare and contrast essay is balanced analysis. This means ensuring that both topics are given equal attention and are analyzed thoroughly without bias. When one topic is emphasized more than the other, it can create an imbalance, making the essay seem one-sided or incomplete. Instead, Aim to explore both subjects equally, presenting their similarities and differences with the same level of detail and critical thinking. For example, if you're comparing online and physical composition courses, ensure that you discuss advantages and challenges for both formats in similar depth. ChatGPT can help you identify imbalances by highlighting sections where one topic may be underexplored. This allows you to revise and maintain fairness throughout your essay. Smooth transitions are the glue that holds your essay together. They guide the reader seamlessly from one paragraph to the next, ensuring that your ideas flow logically. As you review your essay, look for transitions between paragraphs and ideas. Phrases like in contrast, similarly, or on the other hand, can help establish clear connections between points in a comparison and contrast essay. Transitions also play a crucial role within paragraphs. They connect sentences and ideas, making it easier for the reader to follow your argument. If your essay feels choppy or disjointed, ChatGPT can help by suggesting transition phrases or restructuring sentences to improve coherence. An effective comparison and contrast essay relies on strong examples to back up its points. These examples provide the evidence needed to support your analysis and make your arguments more convincing. For instance, if you're comparing online and physical composition courses, you might include examples of interaction methods, such as live discussion forums versus in-person group work. If you notice any vague or unsupported statements in your essay, ChatGPT can help by suggesting relevant examples or expanding on your ideas. Use these tools to strengthen your arguments and ensure your essay is compelling and well-supported. Using simple and clear language is crucial in making your essay accessible and engaging for your audience. Overly complex sentences can confuse readers and obscure your main points. Avoid unnecessary jargon or overly technical terms unless they are essential to your argument. Remember, your goal is to communicate effectively, not to impress with difficult vocabulary. ChatGPT can help you identify areas where the language might be too complex and suggest simpler alternatives. Use its feedback to refine your essay, ensuring that your ideas are clear and impactful.